I want to thank Paul Milliken for another uh, song from his iPod. Now, just when the Burgers with Buck staff thought they had seen it all, here comes the James Beard Foundation's Blended Burger Project. Now, that's a mouthful, you say. Well, believe me, in more ways than one. So, when is being chubby a good thing? Right now, at Burgers with Buck's official favorite establishment. All right, this week, Burgers with Buck, we are stopping in Midtown right here at Colony Square. We are at Establishment. Let me introduce you to Aaron. Aaron, thanks for having us today. No problem. Thanks for coming in. All right. Blended Burger Project, what does that mean? Uh, you're taking probably the best burgers around and you're adding, you know, 25% mushrooms into the burger grind to kind of elevate the burger into a little something new. That sounds pretty exciting. Now, is this just your own creation or is there a bigger picture here? Uh, it's a James Beard challenge. It's a, a nationwide challenge with all restaurants, um, basically challenging chefs to come up with something that's amazing. Something amazing. Well, you've come up with something that certainly looks amazing here. Tell us, what do we call this? It's called the Chubby. The Chubby, I like the name, okay. Tell us a little bit about what goes into constructing the Chubby. Uh, well, it's a short rib and brisket burger grind. Uh, it's approximately eight ounces. Uh, I take whole portobellas, smoke them on the big green egg, mm -hmm. slice them real thin, make two small patties and kind of mush it together around right. the mushrooms. That's a technical term for chefs, right? Mushing it together. Yes, yeah. technically, yeah. Um, and we put on two buffalo fried shrimp on top, mm. uh, house pickles on the bottom, uh, and then I make blue cheese whipped cream to kind of mask the, the spiciness of the shrimp. Wow. And it comes he, on a pretzel bun. It's incredible. You took everything I love and put it on one burger. Pretty much. Yeah, that's awesome. Now, how, how fun is that to, to be able, as a chef, I know being creative is part of what, what probably lured you to this profession, but to be able to come up with something that's a contest and to be able to kind of put your own spin on it's really exciting, uh, you know, creating things um, like the blue cheese mousse. I, 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 you don't see that a lot. Uh, I don't think I've ever seen it before. So, you know, bringing to light issues of food that people aren't usually aware of and kind of combining things that, you know, people eat it and they go, wow, yeah, I never thought about putting right. shrimp on a burger. Yeah, so. How do you win? How's this contest determined? What, how's this going to play out? Uh, we sell it out to the public, and they can go online and vote for the burger they like the best. And the top five in the nation actually get to fly to New York to cook for the James Beard Foundation. All right. Well, you know what? I'm going to give you your first judgment right here. What do you think? Let me hand this to you. I'm going to give this thing a taste. The Chubby. Love the name. I've not ruined a shirt yet, but I know that's a dangerous thing to say before I take a bite of this. Now, I see why you call it that now. It's a huge. Yeah, that's a big burger. That's a big burger. All right, here we go. The Chubby Establishment, Midtown. i got to find a place to attack it. There it is, <laughs> right there. I found my spot. Here we go. Not big enough just for it. Mm-hmm. Well, there you have it, folks. That's the Chubby here at Establishment Midtown. Chef Aaron with Buck. Loving it every day. Back to you. We'll see you in New York when you're cooking up there, James Beard. Oh, I love it. And the Blended Burger Project competition began on Memorial Day. It runs through the month of July. There's a link to the rules and how to vote on the Scene on Good Day section of the Fox 5 app. And you can also find it on our website. And as always, hit me up on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram if you have a favorite spot that you'd like to see featured on Burgers with Buck. That was a good one. Well, it Those looks mushrooms good. inside. That's a, that, was a, that was a large hamburger. It looked good, yeah. yeah. And there's still plenty of places you need to hit, so people need to send in their oh, submissions. No doubt about it, but go vote, go vote for the Chubby. Absolutely. The time is now 841 coming up on Good Day Atlanta. He's only 13, but a local athlete is already receiving college offers. Yeah, but how young is too young to be